Stellenbosch University, founded in 1918, is one of the leading tertiary education institutes in Africa. Stellenbosch has been the home of thousands of students, many of whom have become leaders and innovators of our time. Stellenbosch has long been a pioneer in civil engineering. Our Bachelor's of Engineering degree is internationally recognized and highly regarded. The Faculty of Engineering was established in 1944 and has grown to become one of South Africa's major producers of top quality engineers. Civil engineers are responsible for the design, construction and maintenance of all aspects of the built environment. This includes roads, public transport, water supply, buildings, bridges and dams. The Civil Engineering Department at Stellenbosch University has three divisions Geotechnical and Transport Engineering, Water Engineering and Structural Engineering. The undergraduate curriculum covers each field of civil engineering and postgraduate degrees are specifically offered in these directions. Water engineers manage water resources. Fresh water must be stored, purified and transported. This requires the design of water retaining structures like dams and reservoirs water pipeline systems and water purification plants. Water engineering also includes the design of coastal structures to protect ports and coastlines against wave action. Water engineers prevent flood damage and identify the location of new dams. Transport is vital to keep the economy moving forward. Transport engineers design, manage and construct transportation systems including bus and rail public transport, pedestrian routes, the roads we drive on and even airports. Transport engineers always have to consider road safety, designing transport infrastructure to minimize accidents. Pavement engineers design and construct roads and research more environmentally friendly road surfacing materials. Geotechnical engineering considers the interface between the structures that civil engineers build and the earth on which they stand. They determine the suitability of soil conditions at any construction site and design foundations, earth retaining walls, excavations, tunnels and ensure the slope stability. Structural engineers design and construct large structures such as skyscrapers, sports stadiums and bridges and are involved in fire prevention and safe demolition design. Using concrete and steel, they shape our built environment. Structural engineers analyze and design structures, ensuring they are economical but also strong enough to resist forces from wind and earthquakes. Construction management engineers oversee large construction projects considering financial aspects, risks and strategic planning of construction. The BEng degree is accredited by the Engineering Council of South Africa as well as the Washington Accord. As a result, our graduates can work in many countries internationally. In South Africa we've got a shortage of housing, um, we've got severe droughts, uh, the water supply is under stress. We, we need the, these engineers to supply safe structures, uh, efficient transport systems, and clean water, obviously. And uh, uh, we think in, in future this is just going to grow as urbanization takes place. As a student, I think that you should study civil engineering because it's a very rewarding profession. It challenges you every day, and as uh, part of the civil engineering community, you get to make a difference in uh, the lives of others, and you get to play a role in the country's development. Civil engineering students have to be creative and enjoy problem solving. And as a student, it is important for you to enjoy maths and science if you want to study engineering because we use a lot of those modules here at university. We analyze a lot of structures and systems and we do lab work that actually prepares us for the work environment and the industry. Civil engineering is a fast-paced, exciting career, one that affects the whole world around us. We invite you 
to the Civil Engineering Department of Stellenbosch University to see how we are shaping the engineers of the future.